are you guys doing? I hope you are keeping safe. And today we are back again with another interesting video. Kama K, kama kawaida, you guys. So today I wanted to share with you my morning routine, the routine of a typical Kenyan mom, basically. So my day starts at 6.30 a.m. That's when I wake up, I say a word of prayer, and I relax on the bed for a few minutes, and then get started on my household chores at 7 a.m. start my day in the kitchen because I need to get breakfast ready for my family so that anytime they wake up they're going to get their breakfast ready as I also do the dishes and clean up the kitchen so that I can go to the other rooms towels i always boil water for them and soak them for about 10 minutes before cleaning them just to make sure that all the germs are killed in the kitchen towels
that I'm done with the kitchen, I'm going to get started with the living room by clearing out the mess and the throw blankets that we used yesterday night and clearing out the toys, which I know when my daughter wakes up, she's definitely going to throw them on the carpet again, you know. So that's basically the cycle. You clear them, they are thrown back on the carpet. You clear them again, they are thrown all over the house. Like, that's just it. taken out the carpet just to shake off the dust and allow it to get some air outside because i do not yet have a vacuum cleaner at the moment but we will purchase one soon pretty soon hopefully and also in the meantime i'm going to be dusting out the living room and all the dust prone areas you guys prefer cleaning your house do you use a duster or do you use a mopper i prefer using a duster because it's fast and i think it dries off the water really fast and you know kids cannot fall on the tiles you know tiles can be really really slippery so please comment down below and tell me which method that you prefer using
look at all this sweat and I have not even done half of the exercise. Oh my god, oh my god. This is so hard, you guys. This is so hard. Have you done the cloiting challenge? I will comment down below and tell me how it is for you because my day one has just been super hard. I have not even done half of the exercises. Look at the sweat and I'm extremely unfit. But I'm going to do this. I'm going to finish this. shower and now I'm taking my breakfast this is my breakfast today I'm doing the 10 day detox and I'm on day three I don't know if you guys have heard of Jen Mokami's 10 day detox um, I have done it before but I did it around two years ago yes and imagine I lost a whole five kgs in 10 days like whoa that's crazy so the reason as why I'm doing this um my birthday is next month actually exactly a month from now and i thought that the best gift i could give myself you know it's a healthier and a better me so i'm doing the 10 day detox i'm on day three i'm going to show you the results next week of how many kilos i've lost i hope i do lose as much as i did last time so you guys i'm also doing the clothing's 14 day ab challenge and today was my day one so i wanted to combine them but i'm going to be doing that ab challenge for 28 days so i'm definitely going to be showing you guys the results and yeah and i'm telling you guys this smoothie is really nice like you just blend it yourself um she has a whole 10 day plan program for you so um the first day you have to take um breakfast and then she has snacks that you have to take um at 10 or 11 and at around 4 p.m and then there's lunch the first day there is lunch but you know she has given the proportions and the potions that you're supposed to take and then for dinner you have the smoothie day two you only take breakfast smoothie for lunch and smoothie for dinner and then from day three it's smoothie 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 breakfast lunch and dinner up to the whole 10 days you know so the first three days are pretty hard so i'm not doing any um hard or heavy household chores because i know it's going to be you know i'm going to it's going to drain me i'm going to feel so tired because i'm not feeding well but i'm telling you from day four or day five from basically from day four um, you, you get the hang of it. By the way, this is not a paid promotion by Jen Mokami. No, no, no. I'm just sharing with you guys um, what I did before. So the detox helps by, you know, um, reducing your cravings. 70% is what you eat and 30% is the workout. So I had to get this done. I have to do the detox so that I can be able to lose, you know, to be able to to go on with the challenge and so that I can be able to lose more. So I'm going to be updating you guys with that. And also, if you want to do this with me, please, please do it with me. Akini Pateka Saik Kadogo. I'll be pinning the links below. And oh, by the way, I want to thank you guys so much. We're already at 9K subscribers. Woo! <laughs> I mean, the best gift that you guys can give me for my birthday next month is 10k plus subs. Like, that's my ultimate goal by my birthday and also also lose some weight, by the way. So please, please hit the subscribe button. And if there's a video that you like that I have put out, please share it with your friends, your family. Tell them to subscribe and let's get to 10k plus subscribers in a month's time. And we can do it. We're already at 9k. We have 1k to go. So let me get done with my smoothie and I reply to all your comments. Um, yeah, so I love you guys so much, but don't forget that Jesus loves you more. Mm -hmm.